Hello, thank you for watching this video. This is an overview of the Base Invaders game. I'm going to log in over here using a tester account. I'm going to log in like this. Uh, before showing the login feature, I, I also want to tell that the register feature works. However, I'm not going to show that in this video because I'll have to create a new account and I would like to log in with the tester account that I've already created. I also have this game running on my Linux machine. So you can see that there are there is another instance over here, which I'm going to use as player one. I'm going to go ahead and log in to the other to the other into the other client. And uh, once I do that, I should be able to start a match. So I'm going to click start on the on the Linux client. I've hit start over there. Now I'm going to hit start on the on, on, on the Unity editor. So you can see that it said waiting for two players. Now both players are connected. This is my uh, local player and that is the foreign player. And uh, that I'm controlling my Linux machine and you can see that the shooting is linked. The, sh the shooting is synchronized, sorry. I meant synchronized and I'll try to actually get the uh, foreign player to function. So the foreign player is now going to collide with one of the bullets and you'll be able to see that um, round three started and this is going to be the final round of the game so I'll make the local player or the unity player win or if I don't get shot, probably, yeah, so there you go. So you have a you win screen on the local client and a you lose screen on the on the foreign client. But uh, unfortunately, I couldn't show that because the game just reset, but there was a you lose screen on the foreign client. As I won three, uh, two rounds over here and the foreign player could only win one round. And a leaderboard, the leaderboard function works. And test user was the user with the account test at the rate test.com. So they have two wins and this is the leaderboard. It is working properly in the playfab on the playfab backend. So there you go, that is uh, the overview of the game.